This mini tutorial shows how to calculate a confidence interval uh, for a sample using a T table by hand. Now I'm going to start with the information that we have a sample with 10 observations, n equals 10, standard deviation estimated from that sample of 0 0.5, and a mean estimated from that sample of 4.0. And the question we're going to answer is what is the 95% confidence interval? So the first thing that we need to do, um, we've learned that, that the 95% confidence interval, or any confidence interval, over 2 times the standard error. Okay, so in this case, x bar is 4.0. Now this T sub alpha over two, alpha is the confidence or the um, significance level. For a 95% confidence interval, alpha is 0.05. So alpha over two is 0 0.025. And in the aggress table B, you can see it shows you both. For a confidence level of 95%, you look up T 0.025. Now, we need to know the degrees of freedom it is, since n is 10, the degrees of freedom is n minus 1. I'll just jot that down. Um, degrees of freedom equals 9. So I'm going to look under this 95% column until I get to 9 degrees of freedom, which is 2.262. So 2.262 times the standard error and the standard error is the standard deviation, 0 0.5, divided by the square root of 10. So I'm going to do this in a calculator. First, the standard error is 0 0.5 divided by 10, and hit the square root button. So that's 0 0.158. So 4.0 plus or minus 2.262 times 0 0.158. Remember your order of operations, multiplication comes before addition, so we multiply these first. I'm going to multiply this times 2.262. And that's 0 0.357. So this is 0 0.358, rounding up. So the 95% confidence interval. So we have. Um, yeah, I'll just put this in memory and go 4 minus that. So the lower bound is 3.64, and I'll start rounding off here. Um, 3.642, and the upper bound is 4 plus the 0.358. And that's 4.36. Or 0.36. And that's all there is to it to get a 95% confidence interval um, from a sample using the T table. Note if we wanted a 99% confidence interval, we would have used this column instead. So we would have used. 3.25 instead of um, 2.262. And that's all.